Uh, hi, I'm Jack Sutton, um, and I'm fortunate enough to be the, the, the commissioned artist that delivered the uh, 12 images of my favourite place on earth and put them together in a colouring book form. Like so many things, um, this is a project that has been really, really impacted by the kind of current pandemic. Um, it was supposed to be a beautiful idea that incorporated a uh, community buy-in through the school in Millport. Um, we were going to get the kids to, um, to identify their favourite places in the island and I was going to go get to go around and capture them. Um, my dad's trying to turn me into a, a purist, he's the proper artist in the family. Um, so I was, I was, I promised him that I would go around the island, I would take in the sights, I would sit, I would sketch. And, uh, and of course, we weren't allowed to be on the island for such a long period of time, uh, you know, for public safety reasons. Um, which resulted in me having to uh, hurtle around the island in, about, uh, in a really short day in February and capture these 12 sites. So I arrived at the Commonwealth War Graves at Kirkton and shuffling through there in the kind of half light of the morning, which is an eerie place at the best of times. Uh, and it culminated in me landing at, uh, to take pictures of the, uh, of the pier um, as the sun was uh, setting. So it was sitting behind, so all my photos are absolutely rubbish, which made uh, quite a hard task uh, much harder. <laughs> but... Uh, not being able to sit on site and not being able to spend an extended period of time on the island uh, allowed me just to sit in my own room, my own wee office and and plutter my way through these um, these 12 pictures um, and if you're familiar with my work it's quite detailed um, and people think, like, oh you're very talented and I think, like, I kind of scoff at it because I just think I'm quite boring and like to sit and pick away at these things and draw every brick as, uh, as I could kind of get chided about <laughs> So that allowed me just to go home, study these images, um, and, and I tried my best to replicate them in a way that would be um, that might be interesting for people to colour them in. Um, so for me, the project uh, offered a real opportunity to explore the heritage and the history um, surrounding the island that I really, really love, that's closest to my heart, um, and to, to actually to capture some images of a place that I'd spend an awful lot of time. Uh, and because of that, I'd like to say a big thanks to, um, to Kasia, uh, especially, and also the funders that were responsible for the project. Uh, so the culmination of, <laughs> of all that hard work was uh, the Colouring Cumbria Colouring Book, which I'm immensely proud of. Um, it's been sold on the island to raise funds for, uh, for the Cumbria Forum. Uh, and the original pieces will be on display at the garrison from the 7th of December. Thank you. 